Hello guys, thank you so much for joining me here today. My name is Elise and I'm a certified yoga instructor. Today we're going to be doing a cool down video so that you can cool down after your workout, after your run, or after your yoga practice. So I hope that you find this beneficial and make sure to honor your body's limits and do whatever feels comfortable for you. I also have a warm up video and if you haven't seen that yet, you can go ahead and check that out before beginning your practice. So thank you so much for joining me and when you're ready, we can go ahead and meet on our mats for our cool down stretching. So just like our warm up, we're gonna go ahead and meet in a bound angle pose. So this is also known as a butterfly stretch and you're just gonna bring the soles of your feet together here. You can place your hands on your feet or take those forearms and try to place them on the inside of the thighs and just try to stretch it out a little bit deeper here. Just taking a long deep breath. Inhale, let's stretch out that right leg and bringing the left leg across. I'm gonna place the sole of my foot across and now taking that right arm, bringing it over and placing it down on the mat, gazing over that left shoulder here. Just taking a few deep breaths. Exhale to release back to center. From here, let's take that left leg and we're gonna bring it up, cradling it like a baby almost. And you're just gonna rock that baby. So just rocking here, we're gonna work at the hip joint. Just loosening up that muscle, slowly and gently. Exhale, releasing that back down on the mat in front of us. This time, let's take that right foot, bringing it across the left leg, putting the sole of the foot flat down on the mat. Let's take that left hand, bringing it over and across. We're gonna place it down on the mat and gaze over the right shoulder this time. Taking a long deep breath here. Exhale to release. You can squeeze that a little bit tighter. And we're gonna again take this right leg now and cradle it like a baby. We're just gonna rock it gently back and forth, opening up that hip joint. Breathing here, and exhale, let's release that flat down on the mat in front of us. From here, we can bring the soles of the feet together again, back into that bound angle pose, but this time we're gonna come into a reclined bound angle. So you can just slowly drop the spine back down onto the mat, and we're gonna be lying here, keeping the soles of the feet still together. This time we can take our palms and we can either rest them on our side or you can place them on the inner thighs, kind of adding a bit more pressure. I'm just breathing here into this stretch. We're gonna hold it for a few deep breaths. Just allowing you to catch your breath here. Notice how your body feels and check in with yourself. When you're ready, we're gonna inhale, bringing the soles of the feet flat down on the mat. And from here, we're gonna come to our knees to chest pose, which we're just gonna lift those legs up and interlacing our fingers, we're gonna meet them on the outside of our shins and just try to pull those legs in deeper towards our chest to feel a nice stretch here. Exhale. Each inhale, just trying to bring it in a little bit deeper and closer towards your chest. You can make small circular motions here, just doing whatever feels comfortable for your body in this current moment. Inhale, pulling it a bit closer, and exhale, let's release those legs down flat on the mat in front of us. And from here, let's go ahead and start with that left leg, bringing that one bent up in front of us, placing the sole of the foot flat on the mat. 
So from here, let's take this left arm and we're gonna place it flat on the mat, keeping the shoulder down. You're gonna wanna gaze towards those fingertips here, keeping your neck turned towards the left side. Now taking my right hand, I'm gonna grab towards that left knee. We're gonna inhale here together. And as we exhale, let's drop that left knee all the way over to the side of our mat while gazing towards those left fingertips. The goal is to keep both of our shoulders flat on the mat while stretching out the knee. And this will help bring a nice stretch through the spine. Breathing here, let's hold it. Inhale, back up to center. Exhale, releasing that foot back down. Inhale, let's bring up the right knee this time. And now we're going to be placing that right arm all the way down flat on the mat, gazing towards those fingertips as we take the left hand, grabbing that right knee. We're going to inhale here, gazing towards those fingertips. Exhale, bringing that right knee all the way across to the left side of our body. Making sure to keep our shoulders down flat on the mat. It doesn't matter if the knee touches all the way to the mat or not. We just want to feel a nice stretch here. Just doing what feels comfortable for us. And inhale, bringing that back up to the center. Exhale to release the legs back down on the mat. Inhale, let's bring the soles of the feet back down. We're going to keep them bent here. Exhale, and inhale. We're going to interlace our fingers, bringing those hips up off the mat. And we're going to lift them up, coming up into our bridge. So here you want to engage the glutes, engage the thighs. And just try to roll those shoulders underneath, lifting the thighs up as high as we can here. Just breathing into this stretch. And then exhale to release back down onto the mat. Taking a deep breath down on the mat to rest. And on the next inhale, let's lift all the way back up. You can interlace those hands or reach them towards your heels. And we're going to push back up into our bridge, trying to go just a little bit higher this time. Breathing through the stretch. And exhale to release back down onto the mat. From here, you can just stretch out those hips, making small circular motions, and just doing what feels comfortable for you in this present moment. Exhale, I'm going to release back down onto the mat. And as I inhale, I'm going to come up into happy baby pose, which from here, you're just going to bring those feet up. You want a slight bend in the knees, but we want to keep that lower back still placed on the floor beneath us. Taking our hands, I'm going to reach towards the inside of my feet and just holding them here. This is a nice deep stretch through the legs. And you can slowly rock to either side or just stay flat here, holding on to your feet. Just breathing here. And exhale to release back down onto the mat. Inhale, let's sit all the way back up. Coming into our seated position here. I'm just going to go ahead and come to either side of the body. I'm going to start looking over that left shoulder, bringing the right hand to the left knee. Inhale, stretching just a bit deeper here. Exhale, releasing back to center. Inhale, let's come to the other side, taking that left hand to the right knee, gazing over that right shoulder. Exhale, breathing here. Inhale. A little bit deeper. Exhale to release back to center. Thank you so much for joining me here for our cool down stretch just to make sure to avoid injury and to take care of our bodies after our workout. Thank you again for joining me and I hope that this was beneficial for you and I hope to see you here again soon. Thank you.